everyone welcome back to my channel and as you can see I've got three new pair of shoes that I was kindly sent by Viveva uh, who reached out to me to ask if I wanted to collab so I jumped straight onto the website to have a quick look at what it, they were all about and I can't tell you enough that this website and the products they produce is just unbelievable so I'm just going to run through what it says on the actual website mission statement is to create a stylish and a sustainable footwear that's eco-friendly and responsible so it really focuses on creating luxurious fashion forward footwear with an exceptional quality and a fair price and I can say that after wearing the first pair of cream shoes the flats I can guarantee that the the quality that they've put into this product is just really really fantastic and you can feel it in your feet so they have this awesome technology which is a system that when they're making their shoes it has zero waste process so they create the shoe which is in a 3d knitted design and it ultimately just doesn't create any wastage so in the shoe box, when you open it, you get a shoe care and it literally just tells you how to take care of your shoes. And if you refer a friend, then you get 20% off. But within the box, you actually get a shoe care, which says that you can't dry clean the shoes or bleach them, but you could definitely wash them in cold water and dry them in the shade. Um, it also gives you 20% off if you refer a friend. And it also comes with this tape measuring. So if you wanted to measure to get some more shoes, you have that to hand. Although it does have it on their website. So I decided to choose the pointed toe ballet flats. Um, they're in a cream ivory color. There's also a few other colors on the website. So I've had these on for the whole day. I only put them back in the package just to show you, but I must admit it really does feel like you've got trainers on. The material on the outside is so soft and I had them on without socks on and I didn't feel any rubbing of any stitches inside. And the padding that's inside the actual shoe is just so comfortable. I wasn't expecting that at all. So the padding at the back helps to avoid blisters. So the sole itself is really, really soft. It feels like you're walking on one of those children's playground. And today I wore my shoes without any socks on. And I just realized that you could actually take the sole out and literally just wash them and they'll dry in minutes and you could rewear them. And the thickness of this little padding is just so good. It honestly doesn't feel like anything is going to irritate your feet. Um, I was really surprised about how comfortable that sole in se itself was. The best thing about this shoe is the flexibility of the shoe itself. So even when you're bending or you're stretching your feet, whatever, it doesn't feel like you've got actually shoes on. It's so breathable um, because, of, again, I wore it without socks deliberately. Um, and the comfort of it is if I had to rate it out of 10, it would be a 10. So for shoe reference, I am a size 38, which is a five. I decided to go one size up only because I thought I might get some friction in the toe section, but really you don't need to go a size up. You could just get your size and you will definitely not feel that irritation in the toes. These shoes are actually designed to not squeeze your toes. So you don't actually have to go up a size. You can get your size and be sure that you will not get any rubbing on your toes and it won't squeeze your toes together. I mean, I'm so happy with these shoes. I mean, if I could recommend them to my mum and the girls, I definitely would. These would probably be the pair that I'd probably buy again and again in different colors. So this is how I'm going to be wearing them. Um, when I was choosing the shoes, what I did have in mind was workwear all day long because I always struggle with wearing shoes that are comfortable for the whole day and surprisingly these were so so good so I kind of paired them up with a cream trousers these are from Mango and they can go with almost anything even with like a big a, a summery dress. I also feel like not only are you helping out the environment you're looking stylish and the value for money is great and it's also nice to kind of help like small businesses too. So overall, I would definitely, definitely um, ask you to check out the website. Um, there's also a discount code that I can provide you guys. Um, and I'll pop it up onto the screen. So if you want, please do ask me any questions that you want in the comments below and I'll try and answer them as much as I can. And if you just pop onto the website, it also shows you the different colors. They're all subtle. Okay, so let's open up the second box. So 
with all the shoes you get a care card in them and you get the paper measuring tape that's just standard in all of them I'm just gonna put the box a bit higher so you can see the shoes and I was going to mention that when I was selecting the shoes I really didn't have a hard time finding something that I liked their styles on there are so versatile they've got kind of different looks they've got trainers long boots um, flats and these gorgeous pair of shoes um, I already had in mind what I was going to wear this with um, but what really stood out for me is that kind of vintage chic look um, they're round toed and they've got like a little small block heel it's let me have a look if I can find what size the heel is because it it makes a big difference so this is called the Julie heels it's got um, a round cap toe and it's got a 45 millimeter thick heel for better stability when walking so the idea for this shoe is that you should be able to run in them like trainers and when they obviously were designing this it's all based around pure comfort and I realized that you can't actually take out the padding that's inside there as you could with the other shoe but I must admit it is really really spongy inside um, and they've got and it obviously for the arched heel as well as you can see just there the shoe itself is pretty structured so I'm just going to try them on again and show you what they look like with my cream trousers I think they look really really smart um, I love the fact that the block heel doesn't dig into the back of my heel it actually has this um, added patch at the back of the shoe which is supposed to be like a little pillow for your ankles which means that you don't get any blisters and there's no squeezing in the front of the toe this brand has definitely nailed it I feel like the shoes are not only just stylish but practical they don't look frumpy and just going onto the website there I feel like everybody can get a pair of shoe that meets their style definitely definitely recommend the first pair I mean I can't describe the comfort that I'm getting from the shoes um, and you don't have to actually worry about breaking into them either and that's the best thing these also come in a black base with cream toes but I felt this one's a little bit more classic okay now for the last pair of shoes so these ones are quite different they're called the pointy toe heeled fluffy mules they're 6802 and they come in three different colors so obviously I got the black they come in a rich gray which is actually really really nice I'm not sure why I didn't choose them and also in like a coffee brown color but I thought for me because I had the creamy colors in the other two I needed a black pair so as soon as I put my I'll take these papers out but as soon as I put my hand inside them just take this one out as well oh my goodness it feels like I've got these little woolly socks on um obviously I won't be wearing these with socks but they're so warm from inside um I wasn't expecting that I thought because of the price you'd get the fur just around the edges but I was so wrong they actually go in all the way and the little brown stitching at the front I think makes a little bit of a um, different look to the shoe so I did want to mention that these mules come with the most tiniest little heel it just kind of elevates the shoe a little bit and it does say on the website that they're made for indoors and for easy put on and takeoffs so what came to my mind was that you know when you're at the airport and you have those check-in points where you have to take off your shoes these shoes would be ideal not only do they keep your feet warm and they're easy to slip on and off um, and the other thing so I just wanted to jump onto the website and show you all the other different types of mules that they have but in particularly what really stood out for me was that they resource discarded plastic and then they transform them into durable threads so not only do you help the environment you're actually getting really comfortable and well designed shoes as well um, they have a deodorizing insole and they also have got an anti-slip rubber outer sole um, actually quite, is, is quite sturdy and the shoes actually just weigh 200 grams the one thing that I do look out for when I'm purchasing shoes is the actual weight because I feel like sometimes when you're buying shoes they weigh so much and to be honest I, it's like for me it kind of counteracts the comfort of the shoe so if it's heavy, then I know that I'm not really going to get a comfort wear. But these shoes, all three of them, were really, really light. 
Now I just can't wait to wear my shoes. Once the weather gets a little bit better, it's been raining here in London so much that I haven't had a chance to actually really make full use of my new shoes. Just to say thank you for all the support that you give me on my videos and hopefully I'll see you guys soon. Bye.